welcome. In this lesson, I'm going to do a continuation with uh, some licks or in a style of lick that's kind of like a uh, kind of like a how rugs type lick. But like I said, it's something I've been working on, trying to figure out different positions for our chords and how you can uh, come up with some licks within those positions. This one is going to be an ascending lick. In other words, I'm going up the fretboard is what I call it. Uh, in a previous lesson, we did a lick going down. And you can find that on, on our site. So this one is actually going to go up. Okay, and again, this one, like the previous lesson, it's just going to be a lick in G, and that's just as a reference. You could do it out of... You could do it out of any key, and, and truthfully, you ought to practice them in all keys. Try to learn your fretboard. So let's go to our first fret. So that's kind of a different position for G, for a lick out of G, but we can play some pretty good licks here. So there are licks out of our first fret. So this lick, we're going to kind of, we're going to start on our seventh string, first fret, and that's a G note. So let's pick seven by itself. Pick six, uh, five and six, I'm sorry. So we've got seven, five and six. Slide that up two frets. Okay, so we got seven by itself, five and six as a groove. Slide those up two frets. You get up to your third fret, you pick four, five as a groove. Okay, so there's a lick just by itself. Okay, that's a, a lick that you could just use just right by itself over G. Okay, so now the next part of the lick, we end it here, we pick six by itself, slide six from your third fret to your sixth fret, and then pick four, five here at the sixth fret with your E to F knee lever in. Pick six again, slide it from your sixth fret to your eighth fret, pick four and five as a group with your A pedal down. So now we have pick six here at your eighth fret, slide it up two frets, then pick four and five with your A pedal down. So now we have Okay now here at our tenth fret we have A and B pedals down. So I'm gonna let me talk it from the eighth fret. So we went at the eighth fret then we pick six again. Slide it to the 10th fret, press a, uh, B pedal down, and then pick 5 and 4 with A pedal. So we have... So we get to that 10th fret, we got that B pedal down. At the 8th fret, when we play 6, it's no, no pedal. When we slide it to the 10th fret, 
we press the B pedal, pick four and five with A pedal down. That's our pedals down position here in, at our 10th fret. Okay, let me talk that one out. Oh, well, let me just play it one more time. I'm not gonna talk it out because I think, I think you'll be able to get it. Okay, and that's a good lick that you can use over the key of G. And again, you can take those licks and break them down and use them just as as a part of a lick. So in other words, you've got, like I said a while ago, you've got this one. That's one lick. That's another lick. There's another lick. There's another lick. So you can break those down and, and, and come up with your own, you know. And have that as part of the lick on, on something else. So, okay, I hope these help you, and I uh, hope you're enjoying the licks and uh, things we're doing. Like I said, the main thing here is like break them down in parts, and then just try to uh, move them up and down the fretboard to learn your fretboard. Okay, as always, we appreciate you watching, appreciate your feedback, and uh, this is Aaron, and keep picking.